Hello, everyone. Yeah, so... Not sure, am I supposed to do a recap? Uh... Well, in the event I'm supposed to... Our sister got kidnapped and now we're at an island with a bunch of male people. Oh. And I got blown up by my own bomb. Okay, let's try it this way. Oh, it is. Okay. I remember that from always in the demo. Every time I see this, I think Link's trying to be stealthy. Dusk, is that you? No, do you know any other boy in green? And hang on a second, I gotta turn my TV volume now. <sighs> it is, I'm pleased to see you're okay. I must say, you've traveled far for one with no wings. Yeah, I kinda wish I had wings. And your sister, is she? Is that so? Well, don't worry too much. I'm sure she'll hang in there. I have an idea this. Would you meet our chieftain? I've told my people here about you, and all of us Rito are very concerned. Are you concerned for normal reasons, or because the fact that if someone's kidnapped, that means you can't deliver mail to them? I'm certain the chieftain will befriend you and lend aid to, uh, lend you the aid of our, uh... Ari? Aria? It's so then. I'll fly on ahead and let everyone here know, know you're coming. Come inside, Dusk. I'll be waiting. You know, you could have just picked me up and took me with you. not like that Let me try that. Uh, don't tell me my desk doesn't work.
Uh, let's see. The disc looks is in good condition, so hopefully it's just them. I mean, it was working fine on everything else. Uh, please work. I don't want to have to try and track down a new copy. They're expensive. Okay, yeah, we gotta go through your dialogue, pal. Okay, it worked. I don't know what was up with that last part. Well, have you discovered the cause of the great Bolo's anger? Ah, so you are Dusk, are you? Quill has... Quill, Quell has told me all about you. A troubling tale indeed. I insist that you let us know if there's anything we can do to help you. We shall do everything in our power to assist you. Can you give me wings? However, in the meantime, we have a problem of our own to deal with. When you arrived on the island, did you notice the raging dragon perched atop the mountain? As you can see, we of the Rio tribe are finally connected to Sky. We make our living on the airways. We do so by the graces of the Sky Spirit, Balo. When it reach, re reaches adulthood, he or she journeys to the top of Dragon Roost to receive a scale from the Great Dragon. It is this scale that enables the Rito to grow his or her wings. Recently, however, the once gentle Valo has grown violent and unpredictable. Sadly, we can no longer approach him. If this continues, the fledglings who are of age will never be able to receive scales from Valo on Dragon Knight Roost. They will remain wingless, and in time, our very way of life will be threatened. As Chief of the Rito, my first responsibility is to solve this problem. My apologies, but I must ask you to wait for our assistance until this is done. Will you do so? Sure! Chieftain, what do you think of consulting Dusk with regards to your son, Prince Kamui? Every time I see that name, I want to say Konami. As you can see, Dusk is a gallant young lad. I feel certain that Prince Kamui would open his heart to him and speak freely of his fears and worries. That may be. Let me be direct. My son Kamui is of age to earn his wings. Yet, he is weak in some ways, and in the light of current situation, he may just give up on ever getting them. What say you? Will you share some of your courage with my son? Sure. 20 bucks an hour, though. Will you meet with my son? Yeah. I thank you. We shall do our best to solve our problems as quickly as possible, so we may be head or help you with yours. I have something I wish for you to give to my son. A young girl named Medley is holding it for me. Would you find her and take it? I'm counting on you. Here, Dust, take this with you. Who knows? It might come in handy. 
You got a delivery bag. Finally crafted like this or like this are used by the Rito postman everywhere. Did you just give me a job? With so many pockets, it can hold many items. Select an Yes, you did. You should find Medley in one of the upper rooms. Leave the great volo to us. In the meanwhile, do your best to aid Prince Kong. I keep fighting the urge to say Konami. Okay, so this is a thing I have noticed with Zelda series. Take a look at all these Rito. They fixed this in later one, but take a look here. 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 Oh, you're the fledgling the chief dimension, are you? I feel as though I should tell you, despite what he may seem like real, young Master Konami is a pleasant trouble. Oh, great. Okay, take a look at that one. That one. Ignore the one of the best characters in this game. Not that. Yeah, what is it with Zelda or early Zelda games making races and like only having one ca female character in the group? <laughs> well, you really do have green clothes and a strange shaped hat. <laughs> it's not that strange. You're Dusk, aren't you? Oh, me? I'm an attendant to the great sky spirit, Balu. My name is Medley. Well, to tell the truth, I'm not quite... Oh, whoops, skipped too much. Oh, what am I thinking here? This is from the Chiefman. Does he wants you to give this to directly to his Prince Konami? Yeah, I'm just gonna stick with Konami. You got a father's letter. It's a letter from a father addressed to a son. No duh. Since you just received a fine delivery bag, why not use it to carry the letter down to Konami? When do you want to take it out? Put it. In, choose your delivery bag on the item. So like what, Y, Z, or X. There, the room in. Way in the back of the the room, way in the back on the first floor is Prince Konami's. Yeah, is Prince Konami's room. You have to go down a couple steps to get there. When you meet Prince Konami, please don't get offended by his manners. He has no bad intentions. By the way, um, listen, Dusk, I have a small favor I'd like to ask of you. Could you please come to the entrance of Dragon Roost Cavern later? I'll explain everything then. Oh, she wants to do something secret. <laughs> Oh, please, I know a lot of you ship Lincoln Medley. So, I have a quick story about this story. It's nothing big. Like I said, I have the Legend of Zelda Master Collection. It's basically a collection that comes with uh, the first Zelda game, The Adventure of Link, Ocarina of Time, and Majora's Mask. On there, though, is a demo with each... Hang on, hang on, hang on. I'll show it right here. Each... Yes, well, actually, I do would like to save, so I don't have to worry about that cutscene anymore. Yes. But, okay, so it doesn't show here. But where the save file is, you get to choose three demos. The first one is sneaking around in the Forsaken Fortress. The second is back on Windfall Island, which is kind of the hub version where you could just run around and do whatever. And you get the final one here is on a, well, really on the first dungeon, but you can come back here and explore. Me and my sister for years thought this room was something bad. Which is not exactly wrong, because it has this little jerk. Uh. A letter from my father? Oh, sure, telling me to be brave easy is enough for him. It's not like he's the one who went through that horrible experience. It's not like he still has to go get a scale from the great Valu. You're in this letter too, you know. Poking your nose in other people's business. You're nosy, aren't you? Sorry, but I really don't feel like going to see Valu right now. I mean, how am I supposed to get a scale from him when he's up so upset? What, are you trying to say that you can calm Valu down? <laughs> That's just a big fat lie. It's easy to say that you can do anything. Bragging doesn't cost a thing. I'll tell you what, if you can find me someone who can get past all the obstacles on Dragon Roost to get the Valu, then I'll listen to anything you say. Okay, be right back. Going to go see a dragon. Right, keep rolling stairs. Somehow, for some reason.
There she is. Hey, you actually came. I'm really sorry for bringing you to such a dangerous place. I had to. I wouldn't have asked if I didn't need your help desperately. You see, this place, this used to be a spring here, surrounded by a beautiful pond. It was peaceful and lovely. Great tourist attraction. But then the great Volo, he became so angry and... In his rage, he shook the mountain and this boulder crashed down, plunging the spring. <laughs> you plugging the spring, you can see the result. Oh, but where is my mind? Tell me, how was Prince Konami? Oh, that doesn't sound right. Not at all. I may be partially to blame for the bad turn that Prince Konami's taken. See, Prince Konami's grandmother was the Great Follow's former attendant. She was an amazing woman. I was honored to have her as my teacher. She was kind and brave and unsurpassed in her dealings with the Great Follow. I am not yet worthy of being mentioned in the same breath as her. Does she cook really good? If I only possessed some of her strength, I'm sure Prince Konami would have m felt more secure. Thus, I'm sorry to ask this, but I need your help. I want to go to the small shrine that's near the peak of Dragon Roost, but that ledge over there is so high. If I could get some wind under my wings, I'm sure I could get up there. So, will you help me? Sure! This can't have any negative consequences. Okay, pick me up. Then face the ledge and toss me. The atmosphere currents are really messed up, so pay close attention to the direction of the wind. Alright, I'm ready. Don't hold back now. Throw me as hard as you can. Okay, so... Hang on a minute. It's just funny watching this. <laughs> okay, let's try it again. Okay, that ends the clear. Let's try once more. Use the wind and throw me to that ledge. Okay, we'll do it right this time. Okay, thank you. I think I'll now be able to catch, climb Dragon Roost and meet with the Great Balu. Don't worry, I'll be fine. I may be just an apprentice, but I can understand some of the Great Balu's language. That's not what I'm worried about, lady. I'm not exactly bursting with confidence. But look, if anything happens to me, please look after Prince Konami. This is all I have to give you. I know it's not much, but please take it. You got an empty bottle. Set it to... Set it to and use it with Y, Z, or X. Bottles are great for carrying water and holding other things. Okay, let's that item description was wrong. We all know. Oh, and please don't tell anybody this, that I'm climbing Dragon Roost. It'd be our secret, okay? Well, good luck to the both of us. Okay, what was I saying? Oh, yeah. We all know that a bottle is one of the most important items in Zelda. Seriously, if you have multiple bottles, you might as well be considered the rich man. Yep. And here, I want to do this real quick just to save some time. You filled your bottle with water. Try pouring on something that looks dry and withered. Yep. Okay, so... I'm debating. Well, I'm pretty... Oh, well, yeah, let's go talk to the plot. I just know I can do this as a speedrunning trick. Dust, do you know Medley? You got heard your boss send me to her. Just now, some fellow told me that they saw some unfamiliar creatures near Dragon Roost Cavern. He said that they grabbed a girl that looked like Medley. Which is odd because I know Medley can't fly well enough to get to Dragon Roost Cavern by herself, so I figure it must be some sort of mix up. It is a bit disconcerting, though. Uh, I'm gonna go fix my mess. Convenient that Mendley gave me the thing I needed to go save her.
gotta get this right. God, do I suck? That's one. Dang, I got thrown this far? that on the first try. Doesn't help that I'm technically on a time limit with this. That took more tries than I wanted it to. Dragon Roost Cavern and the game's first dungeon. So, fun fact about that demo. I said each stage lets you get to a certain point for on the timer. You had 20 minutes to try and do everything. I have never been able to beat Dragon Roost Cavern in 20 minutes, but I do know a good chunk of it now because of that game. Cauldron, it's nothing important yet. Okay, take the Deku stick. I wish I was good that good at throwing stuff. Fun fact, I learned that from a video I saw about Wind Waker on the collection. You got a small key. Use it to open locked doors. Okay, uh, before we go any further, I'm going to pause for a second. I got to go to the bathroom.
Okay. That's better. thought that looked like a not the eye that reminds me of Batty but I've always thought that was somebody's nose symbol on oh, the block oh I have died so many times to accidentally cutting all the ropes while trying to get rid of those bats That's my dog's barking. Yeah, so just grab some water. And we got a map. You got the map. Red Chew Jelly, keep it in your spoils bag. This gel on Scoo comes in from deep with red choo choos. It's effective as a cure for exhaustion, but can't be used in this current state. Butterfly necklace. That's a weirdly specific key when you think about it. How do I activate that bomb? I'm supposed to throw something? Yeah. Might help if I can get something over there. Yeah. <coughs> yeah. Convenient 
that didn't blow me up. So who's all these humans that have died here? Because I don't think this is what Rito skulls would look like. Last guy had a giant machete or something. You hiding in a pot with sticks is not a good look move. Fun fact, I didn't know this was Deku sticks at first when I saw these. And I thought they were actually sticks of meat. Not, what does this look like? It looks like a nose sometimes to me. It looks like a weird face. It's a weird symbol. I know how hot lava can get. I don't. Scorch marks should not be just on this ladder. There should be a lot more problems. Faster, boy. Hang on, hang on, hang on. Real quick, I want to point out something. Just take note of the hero sword we have right now. And yes, that is his name. Got a golden feather. Keep your it in your spoils bag. A certain strange ascent emanates from this quill of this beautifully shining golden feather. Wing girls are said to be infatuated with these treasures. Oh, we'll give it the medley. But she's like the only one that exists. Don't do that. I'm getting really tired of that bird showing up. Seriously, why does the bird come back but not the other enemy? I 
did not realize how fast that I actually keep forgetting about that lava part. I wonder how Link is able to even able to get close to that. Because lava is hot. And I'm pretty sure everybody who's ever gonna see this is gonna about to be saying no shit, Sherlock. Yep. But what I'm trying to say is you can't just get close to lava. Especially not that close to lava coming out of a out of a volcano. Which if you haven't figured it out, this is literally just Death Mountain. to when bombs are going to be used every day because I suck. Have you seen any filthy thieving rats around? They're not filthy. I know they are, they are annoying, but keeping your wits about you, they are only rats. If you spread bait near their best, they may share some store of treasure with you. With you. Why don't you try it? Oh, hmm. Hey, I got something real good. I'll sell it to you for real. What will what it be for you? Uh, I need a red potion. Red potion, 30 rupees. I need that actually. Bring me more sometime. More. Well, I am probably not coming back, so you're out of luck. Plus, I only have one bottle. We got the compass. Now you can see where things are hidden in the dungeon. Take this up. Oh, I picked one up and didn't realize it. Yeah, like I said, I have played to a certain part. So I do remember most of the stuff I do in these games. Link to the past would be uh, when I ever, if I ever go back and replay it. Now that I know it's tricks. Yeah. yeah. For those of you who don't know, I did that uh, as a series on my channel. Go check that out, yeah. please. If you like watching me play Zelda, you see me try with quote the classic. I think they had to put it there because if you <laughs> imagine it drops the key into the ocean.
Joy pinned it. Wait, does that actually hurt me? I've never know that before. Where did I put this thing? Messed up security system, just like the torches it opens up. There's something in one of these pots that I know I'm supposed to mess with, but I forget what. That. Hang on, I'm gonna go see what my dogs are barking about. Okay, it's just pain. My dog, I named him Pain because of how much of a pain in the neck he can be, is just barking at the other dog who's barking down the street. And if anybody thinks that's a joke name or it was cool to name my pet that, you have not seen how much my son can mess things up. Right, forgot. This is on the camera. I'm willing to bet that's something important. Probably related to that treasure chest. Treasure turd. Oh, yeah. I forgot those existed.
That is actually the fast travel for the dungeon, so mm, you should know where we are. Okay, yeah, you guys let the girl go. You look like you're struggling to carry that. <laughs> Skull necklace, you can keep it in your spoils bag. This rather off putting accessory would appear to be of little value, but shown to the right person, it's apparently of a great worth. <laughs> Thus, you came to miss me. Oh, thank you. I have to tell you what I found out. This is terrible. Some creature is doing awful things to the great Volo's tail. That's why it's having a temper tantrum? Why doesn't he just move? The great ball of tail hangs down into the room right below here. There's got to be something in there. I wonder if those mean monsters who captured me have something to do with it. We've got something to do. we got to do something now before it's too late. I'll go and tell everyone what's happening. Here, Dust, use this to get out of here. It's what I use to get this one. It's a device we Rito used before we evolved wings. How did this help you get here? You got the grappling hook. This item was used by the Rito people before they had wings. Set it to Y, Z, or X on the item. Okay, yeah, I know that. Right. But seriously, there was next to nowhere to use it. Well, there was, but it wouldn't have been that helpful. Grab this branch with a grapple hook and you can swing over to get out of this area. Good 
Medley come this way? I've always been curious. How did she get here? Falling. I'm about to break the bridge. You know, yeah, come here, Yes, I knew I was supposed to break the bridge. Anybody? Sensitivity. Well, actually, I think sensitivity wasn't even invented back then. It's 
some speed. You know, I gotta admit, for a kid, Link's got really good upper body strength. I could never hold myself on a rope. You got the big key, use it to gain the entrance where the dungeon's boss is. Backwards has not come in handy here. Safe for the same. Yep. The f <sighs> okay, that totally was not right. Thank you. 
Okay, it was worth a shot. A knight's crest, keep it in your spoils bag. All who skilled in the ways of the sword know the value of a crest such as this. Yeah, we totally do. That's worth 10 rupees. This doesn't tell me their name. fight this thing.
I don't know why I'm being quiet. It's not like this is a challenging boss. I felt like this dude was a little anticlimactic. Or anticlimactic, whichever you prefer sounds better. heart container your life energy has been increased by one plus your ga life gauge has been replenished I don't know why I was bothering I can't collect anything anyway Anybody have a clue what he's saying? <laughs> Dusk. Well, Prince Konami, don't you have something you want to say? Um, I heard everything from Leslie. Dusk. Thank you so much. I'm sorry I mistrusted you. I hope I can be like you someday, Dusk. Just wear green, kid. You will, Konami. I just know it. Right, Dusk? So, Dusk, here. I want you to take this, Dusk. Giving you the thing I value most will give me the courage I need to stand up to bad things. You received it. Pearl, this is the gem that Rito's claim was passed down from the great goddess. How convenient that was the thing we came to get here in the first place. The great Balo is grateful to you, Dusk. I have no clue what he's saying. Use the wind god's wind? That's what he said, but I don't understand. I wonder what it means. The wind god's wind. I wonder if it was talking about that wind shrine that's over there. Oh, almost forgot. The great Balo has also named you, Dusk, a true hero. I agree with him. As far as we're concerned, Dusk, you really are a hero. Well, I'm going to go visit Balu. I'll come and see you sometime with the best pair of wings ever. Wait, Prince Konami! Thanks so much, Dusk. See you again someday. How's the kid supposed to get up there? No. 
wrong button. The wind's requiem. Mm. Yep, that's a mighty nice breeze. The name's Zephos. The, I'm the god of the winds. So you're the new wind waker, are you? Great, great. For a beginner, you've got a real nice wind sense about you. I like you, kid. That tune you just picked up, well, it gives you control over the direction the wind blows. Depending on how it's used, wind could be a good thing or a very bad thing. You want an example of it being a bad thing, then you should see my brother. It saddens me to say that my brother, Cyclos, is miffed about his mommy here being broken, and now he spends his time creating cyclones to torment people with. So if you encounter any cyclones at sea, chastise my brother for me, will you? And that is my request for you. seem that Ganon sent those monsters to this place, but that would mean there is no time to lose. We must depart at once for the place where the next pearl sleeps. We sail to the south. Link, get in the boat. Is there something I'm forgetting to do? Well, no, there's that mini game over here that I didn't bother to... Excuse me. Listen, man, you're not one of those native islanders, are you? My problem is, I just have no idea how I'm supposed to get up there, and I have a job interview. Uh... I have never seen him before. Granted, I've only been here once before. Dusk, I hope to get the chance to thank you in person. Medley told me everything. I'm extremely grateful for all that you have done. It seems you helped my son, Konami, find his courage as well. You have done so much for us. I thank you. Tell us if there's anything the Rito can do for you, anything at all. I believe your journey is far from over, but no matter where you may go, we can still reach you. As you travel from Island Island, be sure to check the local post box. We should be to deliver any letters or packages addressed to you, to the post box near to you. How are you going to know if it's me where I'm near? Keep your eyes peeled for the po moving post box, for they may have mail within them. I trust that it's clear. Well, now I have not seen your known face before. Nope, don't believe so. Hmm? You wouldn't be here in response to our posting for some part-time help, would you? Sure. Well, excellent. That's good. But first, to see if you I can use it or not, I need you to give you one little test. Just a small one. Match the seal on the envelope with the same icon on the shelf, and then throw the letter onto that shelf. Real easy. Simple. Yep. I need a sort tin. Okay. Almost had a high score of 18. 
17 letters, great, good, terrific. You pass, okay, you get one rupee for every two letters, so that comes to a total of eight rupees, am I right? Come back anytime, I mean it. Anytime, the more letters you sort, the more you'll earn. Not a bad deal for both of us. Okay, let's see if I can get that cat. I think I get a piece of heart from that, I'm gonna try. Yep. Nope, not doing it this time. Seventeen. Okay, one more try to get because I'm pretty sure I get a piece of heart from this. Okay, well, I'm obviously not going to get that piece of heart anytime soon. I'll come back to it later. Unfortunately, we cannot depart until the wind blows to the south. It would be a fatal Ah, oh, that's what it was. Hold it right there, small fry. A talking fish. I don't know where you got your hint mitts on that sea chart you got there, but if it looks to me like it's pretty much nothing but seas drawn on it, it's a p pathetic. In fact, it's almost an insult to call that thing a sea chart if you ask me. <laughs> What's the matter, small fry? I'm just trying to be nice here. I'm telling you that you got a problem, and you do. Don't give me that stupefied look. It makes you look like you ought to be in diapers. Just listen, okay? I'm here to teach you what I know about this island, so open up your sea chart and make it snappy. There's a real particular cave towards the backside of this here Dragon Roost Island. Yeah, real peculiar, but I doubt you'll ever get there to see it, Small Fry, unless you manage to sprout wings and fly, that is, because you won't be getting there otherwise. That's all I can teach you, Small Fry. But I will do this for you. Since I'm feeling generous, I'll send word to all my brethren living near the islands of the Great Sea. Good bunch of fish. If you see a fish sleeping out of water, when you sail near an island, sell up and spread bait on the water's surface. Trust me, this is a good advice, Fry. See, the baiting process allows you to get a chart. Okay. Hey, you there. You money raking lint. I've read Okay. Well, I'm going to take a break real quick, so we'll be back in about 10 minutes.
Okay, break over. I had to go get you a quick snack. <laughs> Oh, geez, we are going to I need to spend this money. Yes, I do. I not hit my microphone. That thing was shooting over there. Oh, so yeah, I'm gonna go ahead and explain this real quick because I probably should bring it up. I'm not sure how good I'm gonna keep to the schedule, but I'm going to work on it. But I'm going to start streaming every Sunday. Try and do every other Monday. I don't know if I'm going to stream every Monday, but every Sunday, Tuesday, I mean, not Tuesday, okay, Sunday, Wednesday, and Friday. I meant Saturday. Okay, why am I not getting this right? I'm going to try and get Sunday, Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. Uh, generally, hours are going to be somewhere between probably starting trying, let's see, considering I have work and everything. Probably going to be around from 8 to 9. Most likely I'll start at 8 o'clock. Because that'll give me enough time to feed the dogs and make me something to eat. traveling a bit of a distance. So why does the music turn off at night? I always did that wouldn't question that about a I always wonder that about Wind Waker.
guess there's nothing on this island. At least not yet. I have a feeling I need to come back when I get bombed, so... So how does this boat jump? I want to know. Pretty sure that's where we're supposed to be going. Hey! Yes, do you not see what rises up from the horizon? That is where you must go, Dust, the Forest Haven. It may appear as though this is but a great tree rising from above the ocean surface, but it is a sacred place. It is inside a grotto that you will find the spirit of the earth, the great Deku Tree. You must speak with the great Deku Tree, and receive from him the sacred gem known as Floros Pearl. I fear that Ganon's vile hand may have already reached the most sacred of sac this most sacred of sanctuaries. Go forth with caution, Dusk. Okay, but first I need to buy stuff. Oh. oh, thank you as always. I appreciate your business. If you have anything you want to sell, just show it to me. I'll buy it off you. Or would you prefer to buy something? I actually have plenty of Thank you! Now you have four points. Thank you! Thank you! Well, I, I, I get, every time I hear a beetle talk, it just makes me want to copy him. Does anybody else have that, that, that urge? always look so sad when you leave. I've always wanted to know. You got a Baco Bava seed. You can keep it in your spoils bag. This is the source of evil plants magic. Perhaps you can find someone to cook it up. Its magic can be unleashed. to avoid that.
Dang, one hint did that? Yeah, if you don't know how to do that to an Octo Rock, you are playing you need to stop playing Zelda games. That is some really impressive if you can pull yourself over a waterfall. Because water pressure hurts. Oh no, it has multicolored zits. Now I gotta try and collect all of this. Hang on, man. No speak, we are ancient Hylian. Speak. Why do we all have a new language? Link's got my face whenever somebody else in another language wants to ask me something. I must apologize, I was in error. I saw your clothes and suddenly fell at lodging for an age ago that long caused the ancient tongue to pass my lips. I am the guardian spirit of this forest haven, the Deku Tree. I owe you my thanks for your aid in ridding me of those foul creatures. Tell me, what is it not the king of the red lions, the boat who speaks, who led you to this place? Yep. So it is true, then you have come here because you need the pearl of the goddess. I see. I knew there was a reason the monsters had begun to congregate in this region around my woods. Now I understand it. He has returned. Ganon has returned. In that case, we must make haste. Koroks, little turn of the woods. The traveler is not your enemy. Let your hearts be at ease and show yourself. I saw them for a second and I had bat flashbacks to uh, Breath of the Wild and PTSD because of the Korok seeds. What do you call yourself? Dusk? Well then, thus, these are the Koroks, the spirits of the forest. Once upon a time long ago, the Koroks took on human form, but when they came to live on the sea, they took these shapes. Might be the biggest downgrade in evolution ever. Granted, y'all can fly, so now. Now they fear people, but to me, they are ever be my er cherished little children. As it happens, you have just in time come just in time for the ceremony that the Koroks hold, but once every year, it's about to begin. I shall grant the pearl to you once their ceremony is complete. I must apologize for the brief delay, but if this ceremony is not completed soon, an ill fate could befall us. So, let's begin. Are you ready, my children? We are not, oh great Deku Tree. Something terrible has happened. It is Makar. Makar. He owes 50 bucks. 
or rupees. What is it the matter, Linda? Are you and Makar are always late. <laughs> no, it's not that. Oh, great, Deku Tree. Makar fell into the Forbidden Woods. <laughs> what? The Forbidden Woods? That are forbidden? Also, the cousin of the Forbidden Forest from Harry Potter. I told him to be careful, but still, Makar flew above the Forbidden Woods, and as he drew close to it... Foolish little Makar. Thus, you have heard of all of it. The Forbidden Woods are right beside the hollow islands of our forest haven. These woods, the whole region, is a vile place that is home to evil beasts. And now it seems they have taken a children of mine named Makar. Your presence here is no mistake. I deem the King of Red Lions I slightly expects great deeds of you. It is why he brought you here. I'm sorry to ask you this, but can you go rescue young Makar for me? Sure! But, great decoratory, people cannot fly through the air. Oh, uh, yes, thank you, child. You were right. It is not possible for to enter those woods from the sea, is it? Dusk, I would guess you, from your size that you are heavier than my core of children. Yet, I think we may be, still be able to solve this dilemma. You must use the item I shall bestow upon you and fly through the sky. Forgive me, Dust, but uh, you could could you climb up to my cr crown and get the leaf from up there? Sure, but first I need to do something. Turns out I didn't need it. Cheap later. Was I supposed to?
Well, you're quite good at that, Mr. Knight. Just keep doing that until you get... I guess Link counts as a knight. Uh... Oh, right! Wait, I think I remember now. It's gonna stay like that because the time doesn't pass in here. Yeah, time only passes in Wind Waker when you're on that boat. You got the Deku Leaf. Set it to the usual. You can plant your feet on the ground and use it to blow Blast of Era object to enemies. You can also use it to jump in the air and use your magic power to glide. Please, you must fly from over there to here using your Deku Leaf. Swordsman, you've already mastered using the Deku Leaf, but since you came, you're so much heavier than we are, you can't fly very far, can you? How unfortunate. Well, anyway, this exit leads to the Forbidden Woods, where our brother Makar is being held. Please take care of Makar. I don't actually know if that's how you say his name. Right. That looks ominous. <laughs> Congratulations, Swordsman. It appears you've finally gotten the Deku Leaf. That eerie looking island over there is home to the Forbidden Woods. Markar is trapped in there. Okay. I need magic power, so I'm going back to where I saw a bunch of it. Nice miss job, Mr. Swordsman. It looks like you're... Okay. Okay. 
Okay, yeah, figured. He was just gonna tell me I had to use this up for This off drive does not want to work. Forbidden Woods. All the two jellies I can. Yeah, I gotta collect as much of that as I can because I know I'm gonna need it at some point. does run out in this dungeon. You got the dungeon, man. 
Yeah, I don't think I'm beating this place in 20 minutes. Yep. Or less than 15, actually. No doubt fairy was there. Okay, Link. Thank you. Okay, didn't mean to do that. So, if you haven't figured it out by now, these are the... This is the Lost Woods from Ocarina of Time. And, uh, as everybody should know, the, uh, Koroks are the Kokiri, the Evolved. And yes, I'm still sticking with the Evolved. No, it's not because I don't like the... I get mo I'm still mad about the fact that uh, what they put me through in Breath of the Wild.
Oh. Not think I would be able to reach that, but okay. Just a touch thing. I thought it would. Sorry, I'm getting quiet. I'm, I'm not trying to do that. It's just force a habit, I guess, when I play games. I'm so used to not streaming and stuff. It just. Eh. What's he looking at? Okay, I don't see anything. I keep having to remind myself I'm not in the uh, Great Deco Tree. Thank you. 
I forget, have we even picked up the map or the compass? Well, we got the compass. Well, actually, I haven't saved yet. Let me walk through them. Supposed to go there? Sorry about that, my computer monitor messed up. Don't 
that wasn't it. Where I'm supposed to go. Yep. 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 Nope, there's something I'm supposed to... So somehow I'm supposed to get to that thing, that chest in that room. I'm betting you that's where the small key I'm supposed to get is. What am I missing? Oh, 
Okay, so I am an idiot. Sorry, but I was under the impression that the giant vines would have blocked it. I mean, can you blame me? I figured they would have, you know, blocked it. Matter can't go through matter. Oh great, my pollen allergies even in video games.
And it's time for a new item. Yep, just throw the boomerang itself. Sorry, I didn't feel like reading the item description, plus I was distracted. Okay, a boomerang is not that cool in real life, but I'll let it slide. Okay, that shit's cool. I will forget stuff. into the poison yep. swamp. I think swamps get a bad rep. They're not bad. Seriously, I live right behind... One's right behind my house. I mean, so long as you feed the gators in them, they don't bother you. There is not alligators behind my house. There's crocodiles. <laughs> okay, I'm kidding. But seriously, swamps are not that bad. Yep. 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 Yep.
Whoops, don't do that. Why will I not just kill that thing? This does not use magic. No, what was the point of the tunnel then? Wait, that wasn't the big key? That was a treasure? We are not talking about this. Sunshine.
Better not be another damn treasure chart. Is the big key and no I did not forget to turn anything off so Get up there. Let boss. I could try and make a quick run but to go get that forest water, but I don't feel like it, so we're just gonna beat the boss. He 
You think Ganondorf would ever realize that if he just traps Link in a room like this and doesn't have the things blocking the door, Link would eventually just die of starvation? I always wondered it. Why do the uh, doors open when you beat the monsters? familiar to anybody, that's because it was uh, voted, like, number 19 on the worst Zelda bosses by the Green Scorpion. If anybody wants to watch that countdown. That's one thing I'm not a fan of, this whole Wind Waker sword combo. It kind of kills your time and your ability to run away. Yeah. I'm annoying when the boomerang locks you to the Z-axis and you can't actually move. off at that time. I really wish I did bring no freaking cross water because this is getting rather annoying.
Finally! I don't think the boss would take that long. Swordsman, are you the one who rescued me? No, it was the other guy in green clothing. You have my thanks. When all went dark around me, I thought my time on the earth was over. But why are you here, Swordsman? What? The Great Deco Tree sent you? Oh, that's right. Today's the festival of our annual ceremony. Oh, I'm in trouble. I shouldn't be here. I must get out of here immediately. And let's get the heart container. Let's go quickly. Does he follow me? Oh, I was wanting to see him follow me. It would have been cute. Oh, there he is. See, that is so cute. Oh, Makar, you have returned safely. I'm sorry, Great Deku Tree. I know you warned us many times, but I still did not listen. Makar must be a five-year-old. Do not worry, Makar. You are safe now. Just be more careful from now on. You have done well, Dusk. I must thank you for your brave deeds. Here's what I wish I promised you. Please accept it. You're not going to make me climb you again, are you? You received Foror's Pearl. The Earth Spirit of the Decatree has seen fit to give you this jewel, a treasure of the goddess Foror. It is my hope this pearl shall lead you to a fair destiny. When is destiny ever fair? All is well, Makar, do not cry. Please play your songs for me as you always do. Oh, that's right. We must begin our ceremony soon before the day ends. I'm sorry to keep you all waiting. Let's keep the let's get the ceremony begin. Let the ceremony begin. Where did he have that? Oh, great dusk. As my thanks to you, I shall play even harder than normally do. I hope you enjoy it. Where was he keeping that? Tree, this year you have once again produced some splendid seeds. With these seeds, we will continue to spread the new forest across the Great Sea. Let us go, Koroks, to the sea! See you all next year. Take care. Farewell, Great Swordsman. May the winds of chance bring us together again someday. Every year after the Koroks perform this ceremony, they fly off to the distant islands on the sea and plant my seeds and hope that new forests will grow. Forests hold great power. They can change one tiny island to a much larger island. Soon a day will come when all the islands are one, connected by earth and growth. And the people who live on that great island will be able to join hands and together create a better world. Such is my dream. But the one you are chasing is trying to prevent that dream from ever coming to pass. Dusk. Already your fate is tied to the fate of this world. You must proceed with great care. Okay, well... Yeah, I think it's time to end the stream. <laughs> I gotta go to work tomorrow, unfortunately. And... We've done a pretty good amount, so... First off... I have a bad experience of leaving this in the jar. Ok, 
Okay, but we will be streaming Wind Waker tomorrow. Uh, not sure on the time. It is going to be either at 8 or 9 o'clock. So if any of you are wanting to watch that, just show up around then. And I'll see you guys later.